mightiest warrior. The Roman Centurion. Weapon and armor in four minutes. Centurion was an officer in the ancient Roman army. They are often chosen based on their ability and greatness in combat. Centurion led their troops on the front lines, leading and inspiring his men as an example. They also often exhibit the ability and courage that make them successful in obtaining the rank of Centurion. However, because they were on the front line, they also suffered a considerable number of casualties. Each Centurion is in charge of one Centuria, a unit of about 80 to 100 people. They are directly responsible for the training of the legionnaires under his command. Centurion is very concerned with discipline, therefore Centurion is known to often give severe punishment to his men who violate the rules. The famous armor used by Centurion is Lorica Segmentata, the armor consisting of iron plates bound together. This armor protects the chest, abdomen, back, and shoulders. Another armor that Centurion has also used is Lorica Hamada, which is a chain armor. Roman Centurion wears a Gallia helmet, equipped with a hinged cheek protector and neck protector. This helmet is also decorated with some red hairs on top. Another protector used by Centurion is a Griever foot protector, which covers the calves and the knees. In addition, they wear Cingulum, a belt to protect the groin. This belt is made of leather that is added by many iron bulges. Centurion also carries a rectangular or oval shield called scutum. This shield is made from several layers of wood covered with cloth or leather, an iron bulge added in the middle. The edges are also coated with iron. The scutum is usually red in color. Here are some of the weapons that Centurion use. Gladius, an 18-inch straight double-edged sword, with a pointed tip. This sword is perfect for piercing, although it can also be used for cutting and slashing. The handle is made of bone, and wavy in shape to facilitate the handle with the rounded pommel part. The sword was worn by Roman troops until the end of the 2nd century AD, before being replaced by the Sword of Spatha. The name of this sword is the origin of the famous gladiator term. Spatha, a 75 centimeters to 1 meter long, straight double-edged Roman sword. This sword began to be used by the Roman troops in the 1st century AD. Over time this sword replaced Gladius as the main sword of the Roman troops. Pelum, a 2 meters long Roman javelin and 2 to 5 kilograms in weight, consisting of iron rods with sharp edges mounted on a long wooden handle. Pelum is used by being thrown at the enemy. The pilum is designed so that it will pierce deeply into the enemy armor, so that the enemy will not be able to throw it back towards the Roman army. Pugio, iron knife used as a backup weapon. Dolabra, an axe with a sharp pick at the back. Dolabra usually is used to dig a ditch though it can also be used as an emergency weapon. Falx, a sword with a curved blade similar to a sickle and has a sharp part on its concave. Well, that's it. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next video.